Titles in iMovie are typically animated text that gets overlaid onto a clip. Usually they're going to be used in the first clip of a movie or when announcing a new setting or a change of some sort. But it's possible to add titles to any of your clips. So let's apply a title to the first clip in this movie. Select the clip and tap the Titles button. We have several different title options that will vary in what font is used and the animation. A preview of the animation is displayed in each title thumbnail. Tap on one and it gets applied to the clip. To add our own text, tap up here in the viewer. I'm going to enter Deadwood Weekend and then play the clip to review the animation. Just tap to try out different title styles. The last title option is going to be based on the currently selected theme. So it's going to change if you change the theme in project settings. I'm going to go with the expand title for this clip. We're able to edit the font, color, and style of our selected title from here. I'm going to select a different font and then apply a very light blue as the color. Tap this ellipse for more options. In style, we can change this to a lower third title, which will move it to the bottom of the screen, rather than in the dead center. The animation remains the same, though. We can also toggle on or off a shadow behind the text, whether the text will be in all uppercase letters, a sound effect for the title, or to apply the title to the full duration of the clip. First, let's listen to the sound effect for this title. Choose a different title and we can compare their different sound effects. Some titles, like Split, don't offer a sound effect. So currently this title is applied to about the first five seconds of the clip. Activate full clip duration and it's going to remain in the image for the entire clip, only fading out at the very end before the transition. Titles can be applied to any clip, not necessarily just opening or closing clips in a movie. They're a great way to provide context for a clip or mark a change in the movie to a viewer. Using the lower third style is a good option for when it's basically a caption to explain the clip or the next few clips coming up. The theme-based clips even have opening, middle, and closing styles which can be great for applying titles that have a consistent look, but aren't the exact same for every clip in your movie. The opening theme-based titles will even provide a location option. So from here, we can choose the location associated with the clip, where we are right now, search for a custom location, or enter custom text. Pretty cool. 